my phone is like about to die so let's hope, let's hope she doesn't you guys like my shirt i got it at five below it says barbie dream house and then it says malibu california that's so cutesy i don't even have the products like in front of me for this video <laughs> what even is this okay let's go hello everyone if you're new welcome if you're not new welcome back as you can see by the title i'm doing one of those videos that like influencers do where it's like they show their favorite products um except i'm not an influencer i don't call myself an influencer i'm not a beauty guru so i don't really know what this video is going to be going to be honest i think i'm just going to kind of like make it up as i go and just like pull out products I don't even know. This is literally, I, this video is called I Had Nothing Else to Film. I'm literally filming this the day I'm gonna upload it. Okay, so I'm gonna do it in like sections. I'm gonna do skincare, then makeup, then like just like random stuff. I might even show like favorite clothing items. I probably won't, but like I might. So stay tuned. To see if I do or not. Okay, I think I'm just gonna start. Yeah, okay. Okay, so like I said, I'm gonna start off with skincare. So the first thing is this black snail mucin collagen serum by Glam Fox. And I don't know, it just makes me feel very smooth. It feels really nice. I only do it at night um, because you you really shouldn't put it on like more than once a day. But it's really, really good. I'm almost out. So I clearly like it, um, but there's that. Next, Lily got me this for Christmas, but it's this lip mask. It's like a Laneige dupe. It's by Woolsey's. Uh, it's a strawberry lip mask, hydrating overnight lip treatment. And look at me being a beauty guru, but we have the lip mask. And the only thing I don't like about this is it gets on my straw of my Stanley. But, like, that's going to happen with anything I put on my lips. But, yeah, there's that. Also, I know the cap is cracked. We're going to ignore that. And I haven't really been using this lately only because this is sunscreen and it hasn't been that sunny. So, I don't really use, I haven't been using this lately, but I used it all last summer. And I absolutely love it. It's the Beauty of Joseon Relief Sun Rice and Probiotic Probiotics. It's SPF 50. Um, and it smells really good and it blends in super well. So there's the sunscreen. But I literally use this all summer on my face. And it's just really good. All right, this is my holy grail. I freaking love this stuff. I don't even think it does anything. It just feels so, so nice. It's the Mario Badescu Facial Spray. This one is with aloe, cucumber, and green tea. I've tried... I've tried three of them. I've tried this one. I've tried the coconut one. And I've tried the uh, rose water one and this one is just my favorite they also have I think like a citrusy one it's either like orange or like mandarin it might even be peach I don't really know um and then they also have a lavender one I don't like lavender so I haven't tried that one and I haven't tried the orange one because it's new I think but this one this one's my favorite the aloe cucumber and green tea so we have that that's all the skincare sh stuff I'm gonna show because I'm not really a skincare girly <laughs> and um like the skincare products i'm using right now aren't my normal ones um just i get all my skincare at tj maxx and it's just i get whatever is there um so i actually yeah i i can talk about the products i was using but ran out so for toner i used the i think the vol the brand was esfolio no that's a lie it was um Oh my god, what was the brand? Innisfree. That was the brand. Um, it was the Innisfree toner with green tea. And it was so, so good. It left my face so smooth. I absolutely loved it. I'm using this other toner right now. It's good. It's just not as good as my other one. So I, I love that one. I absolutely love that one. 
And then for moisturizer, I was using the Bad Habit uh, Daily Dose Multivitamin Moisturizer and it was very citrusy and smooth and I loved it. And I really don't like the moisturizer I'm using right now. Um, I got it from TJ Maxx, like I said, but yeah, I just, I absolutely love the Bad Habit one. I've just been waiting for them to restock it at TJ Maxx because I freaking love that stuff. Okay, now I'm gonna move on to makeup. Okay, I have four makeup products here. I obviously wear more than the, than just this, but these are just like my holy grail favorites. But anyway, the first thing is the Milani Fruit Fetish um, in the shade Cherry Lime. Um, it's a lip oil. I got this in my um, like New Year's Glow Up vlog, but I absolutely love this. I'm almost out. I need to get more, but it's so smooth. It doesn't even feel like you have anything on. It smells good and it just ne leaves a nice color and shimmer and I absolutely love this stuff. Okay, <laughs> you can tell how much I use this because it's literally empty and I've just been gaslighting myself into thinking that there's still something in here. But there's there's nothing, there's nothing in this bottle. But this is the Maybelline Instant Age Rewind Eraser. You can't even see the logo. That's how much I use this stuff. But yeah, it's the Maybelline Instant Age Rewind Eraser Concealer. Um, I'm the shade 160. I absolutely love this stuff. It blends so nicely. The applicator is really nice. It's like a sponge. Um, yeah, I love, 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 love. And I need to get more. I'm just been gaslighting myself into thinking that there's still stuff in here, but there's really not. Okay, another Maybelline product. This is, again, my holy grail. It's the Maybelline Lash Sensational Sky High. I'm sure you guys have heard of it. I was using the Benefit Roller Lash, which I absolutely loved, but it was super expensive. I got it as a gift and it was super expensive, so I didn't want to buy another one. Um, so then I was like, oh, I've heard good things about this and I have the waterproof one, so might as well try it. You guys, it leaves your lashes so, so long. My lashes are already long, but it makes them look so much longer. I absolutely love it. Love it, love it, love it. This is the shade, I think it's very black. That's a shade. They have brown, black, brown, very black, black is black. I, I don't really know. I think this is the shade very black or just black. I don't really know, but my holy grail mascara, the Maybelline Sky High. And then finally, another Maybelline product. Um, this is the Maybelline Dream BB Fresh. It's a BB cream and I only started using BB cream this year, but I just feel like it makes my skin tone look so much more even and I look so much smoother. Um, oh, and apparently there's sunscreen in it. There's SPF 30. So we're also getting protected by the sun. I'm the shade 110. Sorry, my dog is barking because my aunt just got here, but um, yeah, so there's that and I love her. Now that all that is done, I think I'm just gonna do like random stuff, like hand cream, perfume, hair stuff. Yeah. Okay, so first I'm gonna show you my favorite perfumes. Uh, the first one is Whipped Almond by Mix Bar. I literally just got this at Target. And when I tell you, I you, you can tell, I love this scent so much. The cap is like falling off, but it just like, I don't know how to describe it. It just smells like you have your life together. That's the best way I can describe it. I, I got this a little over a year ago. I got this in like January, 2023. And ugh, it just smells so freaking good. Actually, no, I got this as a, I got this as a Christmas present in 2022. Yeah, that's how long I've had this and I absolutely love it. All right, my next perfume, I literally just got this the other day. It's also from Five Below, like my shirt. Got it on the same day. Um, but it's Dahlia Le Fleur. I don't know. It's a super fancy bottle. It was literally five bucks. And again, it smells so good. It just smells very clean is the best way I can describe it. Just very clean. It doesn't have a strong floral scent, which you would think because there's flowers on it and it's called Dahlia Le Fleur, you'd think there's flowers. But it really doesn't really smell that floral, but... That's what it is. It smells so freaking good. Like, just like clean. Ugh, I love this. Okay, so next, I am literally like a hand cream addict. I use hand cream so, so much. 
and I just started using this one and I literally just got this one because it was the cheapest one there but it's so good it's the EOS that's what it stands for evolution of smooth I did not know it stood for anything. I thought it was literally just EOS. Well, that's cool. Anyway, it's the EOS Shea Butter Ultra Derm Hand Cream. Sorry, my dog is losing her mind. Um, the coconut waters scent, and it's so soft. I'm actually gonna put some on right now. It's so soft and it smells really good. And it says on the bottle lasts through hand washing, and it truly, truly does. Sorry, my aunt is here. That's what that is. Next is this Silky Hair Serum Repair Therapy with Vitamin E and Macadamia Oils. Lily got this for me for Christmas. Um, it's, I only use it, let's try that again. I only use it twice a week. Why did I shift so much over? I only use it like twice a week um, only because it's like pretty thick and I don't want to put it in my hair too often. But when I do put it in my hair, my hair ends up so, so smooth after. And speaking of smooth hair, this is the last product I'm going to show. It's the Function of Beauty Wavy Hair uh, Hair Mask. I just got this recently and I've used it twice so far. And it works so, so well. It makes my hair so soft. It also smells really good. Um, but yeah, it's the Function of Beauty Wavy Hair. And it's really good. It's really good. Alright, so those are going to be all of the products that I show. I decided I'm not going to do clothes because I'm too lazy. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you didn't, I understand. I didn't really enjoy it either. Um, and I'm also like not a beauty guru and I don't have like the expensive products that like everyone likes. But, you know, you do what you gotta do, right? Anyways, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed and I will see you with my next video. Bye.